In the bustling rhythm of our daily lives, amid the myriad of responsibilities and obligations, it's easy to lose sight of the profound journey that lies within ourselves, the journey of self-development. Yet nestled within each passing moment are opportunities, waiting to be seized, to nurture our growth, evolution, and ultimately to lead us towards a life of profound fulfillment. Every dawn brings with it a canvas of possibilities, a chance to sculpt ourselves into the architects of our destiny, whether it's honing our talents, fostering deeper connections with others, or broadening our horizons, the path of self-improvement beckons us with its irresistible allure. At its core, self-development is not merely a series of actions or achievements, but a profound commitment to self-discovery and self-realization. It's about peeling back the layers of conditioning and societal expectations to unearth the essence of who we truly are. It's about embracing our strengths and vulnerabilities alike, recognizing that it's through our imperfections that our greatest growth often occurs. In the pursuit of self-development, every step, no matter how small, propels us forward on our journey towards personal excellence. It's the decision to learn a new skill, to challenge our comfort zones, or to extend a hand of kindness to those around us. It's the conscious choice to prioritize our physical, mental and emotional well-being Recognizing that true fulfillment stems from a harmonious alignment of mind, body and spirit. Moreover, self-development is not a solitary endeavor, but a collaborative dance between ourselves and the world around us. It's through our interactions with others that we glean insights into our own nature, mirror our growth and catalyze our evolution. Nurturing meaningful relationships, cultivating empathy, and embracing diversity are integral facets of our journey towards becoming the best versions of ourselves. Indeed, the path of self-development is not without its challenges and setbacks. There will be moments of doubt, fear and uncertainty, where the road ahead seems shrouded in shadows. Yet it's precisely during these times of adversity that our resilience is forged and our character is tested. It's through overcoming obstacles and embracing failure as a stepping stone to success that we emerge stronger, wiser, and more resilient than before. As we navigate the tapestry of our lives, let us remember that every moment is pregnant with the potential for growth and transformation. Let us seize each day as an opportunity to cultivate our talents, nurture our relationships, and expand our perspectives. For in the pursuit of self-development lies the key to unlocking a life of profound fulfillment. A life where we not only realize our fullest potential, but also inspire others to embark on their own journey towards greatness. First, there are many ways to succeed. Success means different things to different people. Some believe it's about fame and wealth, but true success is living with integrity, following our talents, values, and sense of purpose. Luckily, there's no single way to succeed, and there are many paths to living a meaningful and satisfying life. Exploring various options and thinking creatively can help us find what we're truly passionate about. Success isn't just about doing well in school. Some find fulfillment by overcoming tough times and becoming leaders in their communities. People who dare to challenge the norms can make a big impact and making a positive difference in society through everyday actions can be more fulfilling than seeking fame. For some, success is about spiritual growth, leading a simple life, or putting family above everything else. By knowing ourselves, having confidence, and thinking for ourselves, we can set our own standards for success. Sometimes that means ignoring negative influences that try to make us fit into society's mould. There's no one-size-fits-all solution to every problem, and everyone has unique talents and goals. Defining what success means to us lets us take charge of our lives and shape them the way we want. To unlock our special potential, we need focus, determination, and the ability to adapt, always acting from our true inspiration rather than pressure to conform. It's important to ignore outside pressures and listen to our inner voices. By exploring what truly matters to us, we can discover our passions, values, and what makes life meaningful. When success is defined by us, 
our journey becomes more personal and fulfilling. Staying focused on our goals takes discipline, but the independence and satisfaction that come from being true to ourselves are worth it. Following our own rhythms and definitions allows us to create meaningful success on our own terms. By being sincere in our paths, we pave the way for others to find their own authentic journeys. Success is about staying true to our purpose and creating our own extraordinary journey. For instance, Felton, facing possible job loss due to automation, didn't give in to fear. Instead, he realised his creative talents could lead to new opportunities. Despite uncertainties, he prepared by brainstorming ideas and exploring different industries. When he was laid off, he had a plan ready. Felton's determination and initiative inspired his family and co-workers, showing that challenges can be turned into opportunities with the right mindset. His story proves that success is a personal journey shaped by determination and commitment to our purpose. Next, bless yourself to give and to receive. Understanding the concept of abundance starts by looking within ourselves, whether it's to give to others or to receive from them. It's important to realize our own value. When we doubt ourselves, we block good things from coming into our lives. Getting past this negative mindset means giving ourselves positive affirmations and recognizing our inner strength. Saying good things about ourselves helps us let go of past feelings of not being good enough and makes us open to new opportunities. To start this journey, stand in front of a mirror and say positive things like, I am good enough, I matter, good things will happen to me, and my special talents are valuable. Feel these thoughts sink into your spirit and do things that make you feel good. Be kind to yourself, eat healthy food, take breaks to relax, and allow yourself to enjoy little treats. Let go of any harsh judgments from the past, and focus on growing acceptance and self-love. When we embrace our own worth, we can share abundance with others. When we feel fulfilled, we're more open to good things coming from different places, and we can spread positive energy. Taking care of ourselves is the first step to feeling calm and confident, which helps us make a positive impact on the world around us. Giving ourselves positive thoughts when we feel empty brings happiness that spreads in wonderful ways. Recognize that your journey is special and important and welcome this truth with open arms. The idea is that whatever we give to the world comes back to us in abundance. When we freely share our talents, it benefits everyone. When we put our best effort into helping others, it not only makes us happy, but also benefits wider communities. By focusing our talents, time and energy on helping others, we can achieve common goals faster. Working together creates a sense of purpose and friendship. Abundance comes naturally when we give our all, inspiring others to reach their potential too. By putting our hearts into everything we do, we can find solutions to problems, promote fairness, restore nature, and spread important ideas. Sharing what we know helps others face challenges, feel hopeful, solve problems, and think critically. When we work together, even the toughest problems can be solved. When we serve others with joy and gratitude, it energizes us. Share your best self, your talents, ideas, support, and true self. Make sure your own light stays bright, shining as brightly as you can. The results could change everything. Next, smile with your eyes and heart. The eyes can tell us a lot about a person, whether they're confident, kind, dependable, or happy. It's not just about the expressions on our faces. Our gaze can say a whole lot more. A genuine smile goes deeper than just moving the muscles on our face. It's about accepting who we truly are. When our smile comes from our eyes, heart and spirit working together, it shows real depth, presence and positivity. To really connect with someone, start with your true intentions. Take a moment to pause, take a deep breath and consciously decide to have positive and uplifting interactions. Imagine the kind of person you want to be and the feelings you want to create. Feel a warm sensation in your heart, thinking about how we're all connected as humans and how we can spread kindness in every interaction. When you make eye contact, do it in a friendly and open way. Let your eyes relax, 
inviting a sense of gentleness and curiosity. Think about a time when you felt truly understood and let that empathy guide how you interact with others. Approach tasks with care, understanding and politeness. Genuine smiles create a strong sense of connection, bringing peace, trust and positivity to every interaction. The real value of a smile comes from the warmth and kindness that come from deep within us. Bring joy and honesty to every place you go, leaving a lasting impression. A smile has an amazing power to communicate without words, crossing barriers of age, gender and culture with its comforting warmth. Seeing happiness in someone's eyes can boost our own well-being, helping us relax and reducing stress. Smiles bring joy to both the person giving the smile and the person receiving it. Making an effort to smile can even release feel-good chemicals in our brains, reducing pain, anxiety and sadness. Studies show that just smiling for a minute can lower heart rates and make us feel better. Intentionally smiling can have a big impact on how we feel inside, matching our inner feelings with our outward expressions. Positive thoughts are even more powerful when we pair them with a smile. Over time, gratitude spreads, making a positive difference in our surroundings and in our lives. Opportunities open up and our confidence grows, bridging gaps that words alone can't. It's important to smile often and genuinely, letting it come from deep within. As hearts lift, healing happens, and that positive energy spreads through our environments. The glow we show on the outside reflects the light we feel on the inside, spreading warmth everywhere. Every person has the power to be a hero just by sharing a genuine smile that shows their true humanity. Jian woke up feeling both excited and nervous for her big night, but she decided to embrace her true self and lead with genuine happiness playing her favourite songs and imagining the impact of her music promoting unity, she pushed aside her doubts. Performing at a sold-out concert hall, Jian's authenticity, kindness and radiant smile made her a global icon. It all started with embracing joy and purpose on that magical first night, launching a future Grammy winner onto the world stage. And she continued to smile graciously for decades, captivating audiences worldwide. Next, generate inner glow and radiate outer glow. Many times we seek approval from others to feel important and valued, but true strength comes from inside us. When we take care of ourselves, love ourselves and trust our instincts, we shine with a brightness that touches every part of our lives. From this inner glow, we can spread positivity and make a positive difference wherever we go. To start this journey, Begin with positive affirmations and activities that connect your mind and body. Look in the mirror and remind yourself of your worth. Know that you are more than enough and have special gifts to share with the world. Feel the power and light spreading through you. Imagine a future filled with endless possibilities. Embrace the strength inside you and act with confidence. Engage in activities, be creative, stay active and take breaks to care for yourself. Make meditation a regular habit to keep your mind and body in harmony. Commit to nurturing your inner well-being and wisdom every day. By respecting and nurturing your inner light, you can harness energy and generate positive ideas that spread outward without draining you. Picture yourself glowing like a blazing fire or the warm sun. As you grow in understanding, you'll become more open to guidance from within, leading you toward your goals. Unleash your hidden potential and contribute to the greater good by expressing your creativity. Others will respond to your confident presence and positivity will radiate from you, inspiring optimism. Solutions will come to you and dreams will flourish when you have clear intentions. Your inner glow feeds your outer glow, spreading blessings like a gentle fragrance. Nurture your light and explore new horizons. Our energy affects the people we interact with even though we can't see it. Things like tone of voice, posture, speed and mood tell others a lot about our energy. We can sense subtle signals from each other, like how radios turn wavelengths into sound. Seeing joy in others makes us feel positive too. Dealing with anxiety can make stress levels rise, especially for sensitive people like kids. Besides our brains, 
We can pick up on intuitive info through extrasensory perception. We can sense clear sentences, atmospheres and auras. Having clear insight gives us simple truths about people and situations. Energy carries powerful messages without words. Even though science might not fully understand it, the effects are real. Healers use energy work to calm patients from afar, and passionate speakers capture audiences' hearts. Being in calm or chaotic places can change our moods, showing how we influence each other's energy. As energy sources, we're responsible for the vibes we give off. By being aware, managing our emotions and setting clear intentions, we can send out positive energy, awakening our own and others' potential. Spread peace, happiness and resilience, lifting the energy of the world. People feel emotions beyond what we see, and when we work together, we can make a positive impact on the world. Next, imagine as if think as if. Imagine if by pretending or looking at things a certain way, you could greatly increase your chances of reaching your goals or becoming a better version of yourself. This idea suggests that you can activate powerful creative energies by feeling and thinking as if your goal has already been achieved. Just imagine it, visualize it, have faith in it, and watch your desired reality become true. This principle of acting as if taps into the power of your imagination to think about possible futures before they actually happen. Athletes often use visualization to do better in competitions, and architects picture finished buildings before they're even built. Even teachers act confident to help students feel more confident. Our brains make patterns that look like real-life situations when we imagine different things in our heads. To make this work for you, start by clearly figuring out a vision that really means something to you. Then really feel like it's already happening right now. Make mental pictures that use all your senses to understand it better. Describe specific things like tastes, sounds and feelings to make it seem more real. Play the mental movie over and over until you're really familiar with it. Then act like there's no other choice but to make it happen. When you feel good, you naturally focus on the best ways to move forward and you'll find new opportunities that are already there. Good thoughts easily become real experiences because the world outside lines up with what you believe inside. So create with confidence and care. The present you think about, see and feel will shape the future you'll have. Most of us usually focus on outside goals and wants, always making plans to control life and get things we want right now. But what really happens is that reality shows what's inside us by bringing us things that match how we think, both consciously and unconsciously. To change what's outside, start by changing how you see things inside. If you always think about not having enough and being limited, that's what the universe will give you, making it hard to get more money. To get more good things, learn to appreciate giving and getting without holding back. For better relationships, deal with your own feelings of self-worth, instead of depending on someone else to make you feel whole. To be healthier, deal with habits that keep you from listening to what your body needs. You'll see changes outside only after you change inside. Whether it's for people, groups or whole societies, what's inside shows on the outside. Getting what's deep down inside to match what you want consciously makes it easier to grow fast. Getting rid of bad influences and thinking good thoughts and feeling good emotions leads to good changes in your life outside. Our understanding of life shows parts of ourselves that need to be noticed, healed and made a part of us. Instead of being mad about what you think are faults, use them as chances to get better and approach them with love instead of getting mad. Being able to change with what's going on is really important for dealing with life's twists and turns. Try to be the best you can be and see how the world changes around you because of it. Next. Become better or worse every day. Every morning when we wake up, the choices we make shape how our day goes and what our future looks like. We're at a point where we can either move forward with hope or give up and feel like we failed. Becoming great at something takes time and means we have to keep doing small things right day after day. Problems might pop up fast and stop us from moving forward, but what we choose to do every day decides whether we make things better or not. 
Understanding what it means to be stuck is important because our feelings, thoughts and habits are always changing. The key is in what we want. Are we focused on doing good things or letting bad things grow? Getting better every day means doing lots of small, helpful things instead of big, flashy ones. It's about knowing what the next little step is, being brave enough to face fears, and learning from asking smart questions. Being kind in small ways and making sure we take care of ourselves by resting well are really important. Getting stronger means taking it slow and being disciplined. Getting better bit by bit by getting rid of bad habits. We need to look on the bright side, keep learning new things and not ignore problems or things we don't care about. Instead of just wanting things right away, think about what will matter in the long run. Don't make excuses for not getting better and don't blame outside things for not doing well enough. Face problems and take responsibility. And use time wisely instead of complaining. Every morning gives us a chance to do better and fix mistakes. The choices we make at the start of our day decide where we end up in life. Building something big happens step by step, not all at once. Being aware can stop us from failing again and again. Every day we get to choose whether we want to make things better or not. Taking a confident step forward into discovering ourselves is really important. When our goals seem far away and getting better feels hard, it's easy to get distracted. Every moment, we choose between putting things off and staying focused. Putting off what we need to do might make us feel better for a little while, but it just makes things harder in the end. Worrying grows when we don't do anything and avoiding problems makes them seem bigger. Deciding where to focus our energy can make a huge difference. Getting better happens when we keep doing things regularly, even when it's hard, and we get stronger over time. To stay focused, we need to pay attention to what's happening, push away distractions, be ready to change, and stay hopeful even when things aren't clear. The difference between putting things off and staying focused is taking part and doing something. Doing the same thing over and over is really important because small wins add up until something big happens. Every time we have to decide what to do, listening to our gut can help us choose the right path. Setting goals, finding reasons to stay motivated and facing problems head on all help us see things clearly and move forward. Stopping procrastinating and moving forward makes dreams come true. Next, fulfill other people's subconscious need. Each person has some basic needs. They want to feel loved, appreciated, respected and cared for. When these needs aren't met regularly, it creates a gap that can lead to confusion, fights, and sometimes even self-destructive behavior. A lot of struggles and addictions come from wanting to be accepted and feel important. But there's good news. We can make things better by understanding and dealing with these basic needs in others. Just like babies need lots of attention and love to grow up feeling safe and trusted, when those early experiences aren't good, it can hurt people emotionally for a long time. It's kind of like how plants need care and love to grow. People do better when they have good relationships. Even when we're grown up, we might still want to have strong support from family, friends or partners. By connecting with others and trying to understand their pain, instead of just worrying about surface problems, we can help them feel better. Making a safe place where people can share their feelings and work through bad things that happen to them is really important. Hard times can make even strong people feel like they're falling apart because they're worried they won't get what they need. Giving them a little extra help, like resources, advice or just being there for them, can make things feel more stable. Helping others without expecting anything back helps them keep their dignity. Seeing the good in what people do and think and building real friendships that go beyond labels helps those who want to find meaning and feel connected. By making a friendly community that helps everyone show their talents, we can all work together to make a place where everyone feels happy and complete. Taking care of other people's feelings makes everyone feel better. Even though our selfish side might say otherwise, thinking about others actually helps us and being kind makes us feel happy for a long time. 
It's not just about giving once, it's about seeing the human side of everyone. Choosing to be kind instead of being mean makes stronger bonds, which are really important for feeling good and being healthy. Research shows that both the people who give and those who get help feel better afterwards. Helping others feel listened to, valued and included shows how much we all need each other. When we understand that everyone has basic needs, it makes it easier to connect, even if we've had different lives. Knowing that we need to help each other to do well, giving support to lift others up also makes us feel good. Helping others helps us find a purpose that makes life feel important and satisfying. When we focus on healing together, it gives us a purpose that we don't get when we only think about ourselves. Over time, all the good things we do add up and make life better in lots of ways, like having better friends, doing better at work and feeling happier overall. But the best part is when we meet our own basic needs too. It brings a sense of peace and gives us the power to make our own futures better. Next, become so amazing that people cannot doubt you. Just imagine the incredible feeling of making your big dream come true, leaving everyone who sees it amazed and filled with wonder. Think about your talents, skills and strengths shining so brightly that no one doubts what you can do. It might take some effort in staying focused, but the rewards are really deep for those who stick with it and get really good at it. Every single one of us has something special inside that wants to grow and be the best it can be. Letting yourself feel unsure or listening to negative things from others stops you from reaching your full potential. Sometimes you might feel tired or weighed down by things you have to do, but getting back that energy is just a step away. Change how you see things and get ready for all the great things you can do, leaving behind anything that holds you back. Start by ignoring any bad thoughts or people who try to bring you down when you're working towards your goals. The things you want most help you know where to go every day and help you do way more than you thought you could. Feel confident about how special you are, figure out the steps you need to take with lots of determination and ask people who are really good at what you want to do for help. Work on your talents, learn from what happens and you'll get better and better over time you'll start to feel surer of yourself and you'll find a new strength inside you, turning things that used to be boring into chances to do something great. As you show how talented you are, you'll feel surer of yourself and worry less about not being good enough. Don't let yourself feel like you're not as good as you really are, especially when you've proved over and over how good you are. Keep going, even if things don't always go the way you hoped or people don't see how great you are right away. Being really good at something doesn't happen overnight, but by working hard every day, you'll see big improvements before you know it, doing things that used to seem impossible. Doing things the same way every day makes big changes happen without you even noticing. Feeling unsure can stop us from reaching our dreams because we let ourselves believe things that aren't true, like thinking we're not ready or don't have enough experience. These things might make us feel modest, but they stop us from being as determined as we need to be to do well. Believe in what you want to do, and you'll find chances coming to you when you least expect it. Knowing and being proud of what makes you special is really important for doing well in the long run. Even the most famous people started out not knowing much, feeling awkward, and not being noticed until they got really good. When you believe in how great you are inside, You'll feel free to chase after your dreams without any doubts. Don't let anyone put you in a box or tell you what you can't do. Make your own way to doing great things. Don't worry about how fast other people are getting to where they want to be. Focus on how special what you do is. Trust your gut and don't let anyone make you feel bad about how special you are. Bring new ideas into the world that people need. But first, be proud of what you can do without any doubts. Forgetting how special you are and not using your talents to make things better for everyone breaks the promise you made to make the world a better place. Not using your special talents stops you from growing and stops the world from getting better too. Be brave, believe in how special you are, and go after all the amazing things you can do. You're incredible and really important. Believe it and make it real. Next, the power of humility to conquer fear and worry. 
Recognizing that there are limits to what we can understand as humans creates room for wisdom and guidance to come from spiritual sources. When we put aside our own pride, we can connect with a deep grace that's beyond just our earthly wants. Knowing that we don't have all the answers allows us to discover deeper truths. Surrendering or letting go can feel really freeing. When we're honest about our intentions and don't have any selfish reasons behind them, and when we're humble, we can see things from a bigger perspective. We realize that it's not just about us, it's about making things better for everyone. Our role in making the world a better place becomes clearer when we focus on principles that aren't just about getting attention or getting ahead. The purpose becomes stronger, and we make progress by following rules that are bigger than just ourselves. We get support in unexpected ways, and our community helps us through tough times by sticking with us and believing in the same things we do. Little by little, good things add up, and when we believe in ourselves, we can overcome our fears. It's better to keep going steadily than to worry too much, and being brave means acting with love even when we're scared. It all starts with being humble and trusting that there are lots of possibilities out there. When we admit that we don't know everything, we open ourselves up to being guided by something bigger than us. This brings clarity to our lives and helps us feel less uncertain. Remembering why we're here and staying humble helps us not be controlled by fear or worry. Most people see the world as a solid place where things stay the same, but wise people have always known that there's more to it. They've seen that this world is like a big magic trick. It looks real, but it's not. It's made up by our thoughts and feelings. Our lives happen in ways we can't always understand. Both scientists and people who talk about spiritual things agree that we're not just bodies walking around. We're something bigger. Physical things are made of tiny bits that come and go really fast. And what we are is more like the part of us that sees and feels things. But sometimes we only pay attention to what our bodies and society tell us to. And we forget about other things. Realizing that our lives are like stories we're making up gives us the power to change them on purpose. We have more control over what happens than we think. Things can change fast when we stop believing in limits. It starts by questioning what we think is normal or impossible. By looking inside ourselves, we can find something really special that connects all of us, no matter how different we seem. When we're calm and centered, we can create the life we want. Even though the world might seem like it's not real, we lose control when we just go through the motions without really thinking. Wake up and take control again. You have the power to imagine, create, and be in charge of your own story. Look at things in a new way, and you'll see how life falls into place in ways you couldn't even imagine. Now is the time to take control and remember who you really are. Next. Fail your way to success deepest. In everyone's career journey, there's a desire to do something meaningful, to use our talents and fulfill our purpose. But often the usual paths focus more on avoiding risks, seeking security and hitting certain goals than on personal happiness. Many end up feeling empty even after reaching those goals society tells us to chase. Luckily, there are different ways to succeed that can bring personal growth and fulfillment. Learning from failure is super important. While we often think being perfect means never messing up, true mastery comes from making mistakes and learning from them. In places where failure isn't accepted, people chase perfection instead of getting smarter. Big achievements like groundbreaking discoveries or amazing artworks come from taking risks and trying new things, even if it means making mistakes along the way. Throughout history, Innovators have seen mistakes as chances to learn and change direction. Instead of seeing failure as the end of the road, they see it as a sign to change course and make things better. Each time they mess up, they get closer to their goals, based on what they believe in, not what everyone else says. By redefining what success means, new generations can focus on helping others instead of just fitting in. You don't have to play it safe or water down your ideas to make a difference. Trying new things without worrying about failing can help solve big problems in new ways. Trusting your instincts and following your own path is important, even if others don't understand. 
Keep moving forward, even if you stumble along the way. Ignoring your needs can hurt how you see the world and how you connect with others. Asking for help can feel scary, but it's better than keeping everything inside. It's important to ask for what you need in a way that makes it easy for others to help. We all want to be respected, valued and supported. Ignoring these basic needs can make it hard to connect with others. Being clear about what you need can help kind people step in and lend a hand. Don't be afraid to suggest things that bring people together and show you care about friendship. If you feel left out by your friends, it's okay to ask for help or just a kind word. Offering help to others shows you're open to receiving it too. Good communication is key to understanding each other in relationships. It's important for everyone to express their needs kindly and respectfully. Being open to giving and receiving help can lead to stronger connections. Sharing what you need in a clear and polite way can make it easier for others to help out. Next, compounding daily effort. Many times we see amazing achievements and think they happened easily. But when we look closer, we see that successful people or groups got there through hard work every day. It's like the idea of small gains in math. Making little improvements over time adds up to something big. Winners don't usually jump to success all at once. They get there by steadily moving forward bit by bit. Athletes become champions by practicing their moves over and over again. Getting rich happens by saving and investing a little money regularly. And strong relationships grow from showing care every day, not just on special occasions. To get better at something, you need to practice regularly and think about how you can do better. We get good by winning lots of small victories over time. Every choice we make with a bigger goal in mind brings us closer to success. Even when we don't see results right away, sticking to our plans helps us grow. Keep showing up and doing your best every day and you'll see your efforts pay off over time. Don't worry if things are going slow. Believe in the power of working hard every day, even when you don't feel like it. Keep pushing forward, focusing on long-term goals instead of quick fixes. Start small and work on your big dreams a little bit every day. You can become wealthy by making small improvements over time. Society often tells us to look for approval from others to feel good about ourselves. But real success comes from taking charge of your own life and going after your dreams with confidence. The world needs what you have to offer. Don't wait for others to tell you what you're good at. Find your strengths and ideas and go for it. Don't let labels hold you back. Make your own path and break free from what's expected. Instead of waiting for someone else to teach you, take small steps to learn and try new things. Get really good at the basics before you try to do anything big. Focus on helping people in your community and show what you can do with small experiments that push the limits. Show people what you can do instead of just talking about it. Keep going, even when things get tough. If you believe in yourself and your potential, you'll find the support you need to make your dreams come true. When you take action and believe in yourself, things start to fall into place. You've got what it takes. Go out there and make your mark on the world. Lastly, begin and the power will appear. Starting a new project might feel hard at first, but once we take that first step, something amazing happens. We get a boost to help us keep going. Even if the future seems scary, if we focus on moving forward one step at a time, we'll see progress. And guess what? Making progress leads to even more progress. When we start a project, it's like magic doors open. Suddenly, we find resources we didn't know we had, and support comes from unexpected places. Ideas start flowing, and we feel more creative and excited, even if we were doubtful at first. Everything we need to succeed is already there, but we have to start things off by taking that first step. Taking action gets the creative forces going. When we dive into a project with determination, it gains momentum on its own. New opportunities come up, we meet new people, and things start to happen. If we keep showing up and putting in effort, we can achieve amazing results. What seemed hard in the beginning becomes easier as we work toward our goals. We break big tasks into smaller ones, gather what we need, and make plans, no matter how big or small. 
Taking real steps shows that we're serious and committed. By starting and taking action, we gain the power to finish any project or bring any idea to life. Understanding the idea of progress helps us unlock our creativity. Every big journey starts with that first step. When the universe sees that we're determined, it supports us. Sometimes we hold back because we think we need to know everything or have a perfect plan, but waiting for the perfect moment might mean we never start. The best way to learn is by doing things. When we try, we see where we need to learn more and we keep going. Putting in effort helps us get better, even if we face challenges along the way. Having a positive mindset helps us overcome those challenges instead of being scared. Every try, mistake and lesson learned brings us closer to being really good at what we're doing. Being open to learning is important for making progress. We can change our plans based on what we learn and stay curious and flexible. Instead of waiting for the perfect time, let's start now, even if we don't have all the answers. Congratulations on completing this transformative journey where you can unlock your full potential and become so amazing that doubts from yourself or others won't affect you. By using what you've learned here in your everyday life and taking bold steps, you have all you need to achieve extraordinary results. When we fully embrace personal growth and work hard to master ourselves, what others think of us becomes less important. As time passes, you'll see evidence of your growth, both inside yourself and in your achievements. With patience and determination, you can reach a level of excellence that breaks through any limits people might have set for you. As you keep sharing your talents, passions and true self with the world to help others, remember that your power comes from within. Your worth isn't defined by any title or achievement. It's something you were born with and it stays with you no matter what changes happen around you. You have incredible potential and endless possibilities waiting to be realised every day. Now go after your bigger purpose with confidence. Don't be too hard on yourself and focus on making progress instead of being perfect. You have strength, wisdom and talents that you might not even be aware of yet. But if you keep working on yourself, you'll uncover all the amazing things you're capable of. It would be incredible to see you surprise yourself and the world with what you can do. Thank you for listening.